The world could be tough for a stud. Good thing I've got these guys to watch my back. This is Jake. He's one of my best friends. Then there's Slade. Together, we're unstoppable. We make a crew called the Swole Patrol. They're always there to watch my back in the gym, at the bar, and in the bedroom. I tell you, sometimes I wonder what type of man I'd be without him. You know, she was dancing at the Rhino. She seemed like she was fucking cool, you know? And yeah, she man. Like, and she let me watch my fucking racing. She didn't give me shit. And now, ever since she did that big layout in D-Cups and Dirt Bikes Magazine, dude, she's got a fucking attitude. She comes home trying to tell me what to do. You know what? She got a fucking big head, bro. <laughs> 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 Not like your big head, though, huh? shriveled up, brother. You know, I've been drinking this creatine for about seven years now, and my kidneys have failed seven times, but still getting a good pump out of it, brother. Still got a great ratio of body fat to swoleness. It's like Brandon told me the other day. She said, you know, you keep pumping that shit in your body, you're gonna die. And I said, they'd have to build a fucking huge casket. <laughs> got it right, you know? What do you mean? They f***ing throw bitches in ovens and shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, whatever it takes, right, bro? Hey, whatever it takes. In the bedroom, in the weight room, out of the streets. You can't. Put on my bandana, Jake's here. Whatever it takes, huh? Listen, it's like my dad once told me. I forgot what he said. F***ing bitches. <laughs> You know, the f***ing whey protein, man, makes me feel all right, makes me feel swole, makes me sit on the toilet for about seven <laughs> hours a day. Is that in 2002? It's a good year. Yeah, 02. I'll get up. Let's go. Scoop it up. Go ahead. Throw it right in there. It smells like victory. Ah! <laughs> victory. Victory. Just going to flop it right in there. Get in there. Get in there. Ah. <laughs> you know what it tastes like? <laughs> Being part of the swole patrol. Yeah! Having this little chat with Jake and Slade really made me think. Maybe I need a second to get outside myself, which would be hard, because I'm fucking huge. But the truth is, I do need to reevaluate the way I think about shit. What I'm saying is, just fucking reevaluate your priorities. Like my old, my dad, fucking Balls Deep Senior, used to tell me. <laughs> he was the greatest. He was, dude. Get your shit in perspective and reevaluate your priorities. It's gotta be lifting, yeah. sirloin, <laughs> skin tight at Hardy, <laughs> dirt bikes, it's lifting, <clears throat> extreme denim, <clears throat> and then f***ing women. You know, I used to work at Chillers. F yeah. I used to bounce at Chillers, and you know, the other day I was in line at Chillers, you know, it's all like, oh, my bros still work there, and I'm in line, right. and they let these three bitches in in front of me, and I'm like, Man, I used to run chillers. I run chillers. What the f is this? Get me in there! It's just f that, huh? It's just like 9 11. <laughs> uh, the other day, my mom calls me. And she's like, hey, Bitch. Me. She's like, Johnny B. She's like, JB. She's like, JB, what are you doing? I said, growing. <laughs> <laughs> USDA grade A beef. Hey, bitch. Every day when I go in the gym, I'm just, you know, you know, Man, I'm gonna get stronger today. You know, I go with that mindset, you know, I'm gonna get better today. You know, and I always do. I can't wear a shirt anymore or tie a tie, my neck's too big. <laughs> Still. Uh, Bottom line. <laughs> women. Yeah. Uh.